Welcome to general readings for, oh my gosh, we're in June already. Your money readings are going to look like this and your love readings are gonna look like this. And so you can be looking forward to those to come out throughout the month. So let's get started. Gemini. Okay, so they're saying, get the fuck outside, move your ass. Your body needs to have some movement, okay? Um, if you think about yourself as a drink, like a kombucha or something, it has to get shook up a little bit so it's not nasty. Um, they're saying this is going to help open up your psychic awareness, your third eye, to help you complete things that you want to in regards to your career and your goal setting. It'll help you to wrap things up, finish up projects and things like that. That's the general theme for you. Now, the beginning of the month, they're saying um, there's going to be some honest conversations and a lot of truth that comes to light. And that might make you feel like, oh shit, like things aren't gonna move as quick as I want them to. When you get to the middle of the month, your intuition might be a little bit off, which is why it's gonna be so important to get your body moving around to kind of tune that back in. When you get to the end of the month, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. So the best part of the month is that like, you know, like I said, the things that suck, the things that hurt us a little bit, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger sort of stuff, they're all lessons. Like things can feel bad that happens to us, but nothing's really bad because we learn something from it. So um, that's actually a good thing. And they're saying it's all about how you decide to view things, what mindset you decide to adopt, okay? We can't control some things that happen to us um, that happen in the world, but we get to choose our reaction to it. So the biggest challenge for you is going to feel balanced about this, to have one foot in reality and one in your emotions, but not to go totally you know, um, logical and planning and like, what can I do and what can I control and then avoid your emotions, but not to sink entirely into those at the cost of everything else. So your crystal of the month, um, there's a blog post that looks like this that will explain how those can help you out if you have those at home. And I love you so much.